In this problem, we're going to find the derivative of this function, and we're going to do it using something called the quotient rule. So the formula for the quotient rule is as follows. So if you have a function, which we'll call f, and it's divided by another function, which we'll call g, and you take the derivative, you can think of it as follows. So f is your top function, and g is your bottom function. So it's the derivative of the top times the bottom minus the top times the derivative of the bottom all over the bottom one squared. So that's the quotient rule. All right, let's apply it to our problem here. So f prime of t is equal to, so our top function here is sine t. So the derivative of sine is cosine. So the derivative of the top is cosine t. That's the derivative of the top times the bottom, which is t, minus the top, which is sine t, times the derivative of the bottom. Well, the bottom function is t, so its derivative is 1, all over the bottom 1 squared. Let's just double check that. I'll use a different color here. So it's the derivative of the top, which is cosine t, times the bottom, which is t minus the top, times the derivative of the bottom, which is 1 over the bottom 1 squared. And there's nothing else you can really do here except maybe rewrite it. I'm going to put the t in front of the cosine because it looks a little bit better. And we don't have to write the 1 here next to the sine. So I'll rewrite that. And it's all over t squared. And this would be a perfectly acceptable answer. I hope this video has been helpful.